we, uh, we started off in, uh, was it, how do you pronounce it? It starts with K, Kira. Kira Serena, which is a great We went park. to the theatre of Entrance of the City, Dionysus. What you see around you is the Theatron, um, and so you would have all Athenian citizens coming into here. Um, so they could be archons, aristocracy, everything like that. And then we made our way up to the Acropolis. Which is right behind us. Which is sitting behind us there. And witnessed the rebuild, uh, the restoration of it, which is pretty amazing. It's going slow, it's right. Um, uh, yeah, we've learned a lot. Fine. Think about the wall that was built by... Uh, how do you pronounce his name? Themistocles. Themistocles. wall. Uh, to stop the um, Persians. Oh yeah, we visited the ancient Athenian um, burial grounds where the walls of the city were originally built. Pyramicus. That's, that's the one I was asking about. Pyramicus. Yeah, it's been pretty great. Stop crying. <laughs> but I do think it is their husband's fault that wives should fall. Say that they slack their duties and pour our treasures into foreign laps, or else break out in peevish jealousies, throwing restraint upon it was just surreal and actually getting that experience and hearing all of the reverberations and the acoustics and everything and just seeing what it would have been like to perform, it was just amazing. Finally, after studying it last year, I had about a hundred photos under it. Um, I think the whole thing about the Iliad, studying, studying Agamemnon and everything in the Iliad really got me. You're blind today. Really? I can't yeah. see anything, I'm blind. <laughs> you were so satisfied and you just knew that you were walking in like places that like Rome? Greeks. Greeks? <laughs> we're walking like thousands of years ago and it just really helps you um, connect with what you're doing because and it makes you admire them a lot more because you see all this work that they're doing that we haven't figured out how to do and they're doing it without all like the machinery and things that we have and so it was just really really inspiring. Olympia was great because we got to see the original site of the Olympics, we had a race which was really fun um, there was lots of ruins to look at, especially the famous sculptor Phidias's workshop. It wasn't just being there that made it, it was all the people that you're with and there was just so many jokes and everything going around and talking about what you learned about in class with these people and being over there with them. It seemed more real than a lot of other things we had been to because it was so big and so intact, it seemed like it really could have been a city rather than you know just a few fallen over pillars or a crumbled building it was a real full city the bodies that have been found in pompeii that were you know completely intact and you could see their facial expressions and how they died and it was kind of surreal it was shocking for sure is it, is it like essentially the biggest piece of augustan propaganda ever because it's because he wrote it yes yeah he wrote it and um it's basically about all of his conquests and his triumphs and everything that he did for Rome, essentially, and how great he was. The Colosseum, and its immense scale, kind of reinforces what we've been learning about how the Romans, like, the bigger and better the kind of architecture you build, the more, like, wealth and prominence you show, the more standing you have. Well, Delphi was a lot different from all of the other sites we went to in the sense that it was high up in the hills, um, way, way, way above sea level. Um, 
being up there in the huge rock cliffs and overlooking massive valleys of olive trees is such an amazing location. Such a spiritual place because it's this location where people would go to supposedly directly commune with the gods. So it has this atmosphere about it where you know that like thousands of years ago this was essentially a spiritual epicenter. It really made it a lot more memorable because you're not just seeing sites but you're seeing them with friends and with teachers and everyone's just becoming a lot closer.